Do you think maybe it'll melt the chocolate? Yeah. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. <laughs> uh, it's New Year's Eve. I'm eating this. <laughs> Awful. There's not a whole bag of them or anything. Okay. I don't know about you guys, but we had a really exciting year. I choked on my spit. Before we get to the recipe, which is chocolate pie, we want, no, I, we, we, right, want to thank everyone uh, for watching uh, our new channel. It's been so much fun. This year, this past year has been, has been full of new things and new adventures, and this was a big scary step for me, as most things were this year, Mommy. and I'm just really happy I did it. I think my dad would be really proud of me and I'm really proud of me and are you proud of me yeah oh cool so to share some of the highlights of this past year real quick because um, I just never thought I would do the things that I did Vasily and I took a nine-hour car trip to a gaming convention for him to meet his youtubers that he loves OB. beautiful OB Komodo. Komodo Gaming. Frustrated hey. Gamer. Brandon, the Frustrated Gamer. Which, I don't I know. Like if, spy cakes but not Spy love. Cakes. Yeah. I love of, Spy Cakes. I know, because of COVID, Spy Cakes couldn't be there. But I'm sure we'll see him in another one. But even though I uh, have a fear of driving long distances, I did it. And I did good. I didn't freak out. Uh, don't do well with a lot of people in a new setting. And I did it. The convention went well. I was really excited. I was really excited to meet OB and um, made, a, made a bit of a fool of myself, but that's okay. Uh, it wouldn't be me if I wasn't weird and awkward, right? <laughs> um, their channels are great, by the way. I'll tag them in the description so you guys can check them out if that's something you're into. But they're hilarious and, um, you know, try it out. Also, if any of them happen to see this, However, that would work. I lost your guys' autograph. I can still hear it. <laughs> I lost your guys' autograph. And uh, he's been asking, so if there's a way that I can get another one, I guess. Um, so if there's a way that I can get uh, some new autographs, that would be great. Mm -hmm. I'd pay for them, of course. <laughs> ah! Oh. Anyway... <laughs> it was great meeting you guys. You were all very nice. And uh, OB, sorry. <laughs> Besides that, I got on a plane for the first time. Uh, went on a trip by myself for the first time, just me and my best friend. This guy right here. Huh? And uh, did well. Anyway, we had a lot of new things. Um, and I'm very excited for the new year because uh, if y'all are... Um, annoyed with me which I don't know why you would be I'm quite fun <laughs> but thank you for supporting my little tiny channel you know watching me do my thing because I'm gonna keep doing it and it'll probably get a lot more frequent but you know so now we're gonna get to the recipe it's a no-bake pie of course I got a couple kinds of chocolate uh, leftover Christmas chocolate bar I don't know how much you'd say that was. It's about a half cup. This is milk chocolate. This is semi-sweet chocolate. Um, you can use all semi-sweet, but because I got a kid eating it, I didn't want it too bitter. Um, then we have sugar, and that is for the <laughs> for the whipped cream. And um, and then there's cream of tartar and sugar for the egg whites. Cream of tartar is going to help keep it stable, so when we're folding it in, they don't deflate as easily. Then this is just a ready-made uh, graham cracker crust. It's always better to make your own, but you know, I didn't. It's three-fourths of a cup or four large egg whites. Gonna whip them on high until we get some stiff peaks. Gradually gonna mix in. 
one teaspoon of cream of tartar, and two tablespoons of sugar. Uh, I am aware that people don't like raw egg whites um, in things. Okay. Um, but you know, I have pasteurized egg whites, so I'm not worried about it. But I'm going to whip those up. It's a cup and a half of heavy cream, a tablespoon of vanilla, and then three tablespoons of sugar. Um, it's going to go into that while we whip it. I'm going to go ahead and do that. I'm also <laughs> going to melt my chocolate, which is one cup of the bittersweet chocolate and then about a half cup of milk chocolate. I'm going to melt those down because those uh, are going to melt those down because then we're going to fold in our heavy cream and our egg whites into our chocolate. So I forgot to mention, as I usually do, with <laughs> you're going to melt down a tablespoon of butter and mix it in. So after it's melted, take a little bit of your whipped cream. And this part you don't have to be delicate with because this is just us trying to uh, make the chocolate mixture lighter so it's easier to fold it in. We have our egg whites. Look how shiny they are. Make sure when you're adding in your sugar that you add it uh, while they're still frothy before they start getting peaks to them. If you add it to close to the end, then it's going to stay grainy. Fold in the egg whites. We're going to alternate between this and the whipped cream. Then I doubled the amount because some of it's going to go on top. And when you fold it in, I know this is something that's difficult for some people too, to understand what that means. You're going to cut down the middle and fold over. Cut down the middle, middle. fold over. If you have extra, give it to your kid. Okay, now it goes in your fridge for five to six hours. Time for the whipped cream. If you want this to look fancy, you can totally pipe it on top. I like how it looks when it's just kind of not neat. Anyway. I like this would be top. Now you can shave chocolate on top. You can chop chocolate and put it on top. You can drizzle chocolate syrup if you want. I have some little chocolate sprinkles. I'm going to put that on top. What's up, kid? Now I'll cut it so you can see what it looks like on the inside. Look at it. Does it look great? Not on the inside. Right now. Where's my paws? So. Ah. Oh. <laughs> you're a freaking horn. I'm scared of a Jesus daddy. <laughs> so what did you guys have for New Year's dinner? Vasily had some uh, very specific requests: chocolate pie, uh, shrimpies shrimp cocktail and uh, an apple pie I didn't sort have time of. for both huh? sort of an apple pie sort of an apple pie <laughs> I hate creamy cramp cramp <laughs> I'll make it a nice big slice so it's easy to <laughs> What, take it out? Yeah. yeah. Oh, ooh. ooh, lift up. Lift up. Um. <laughs> so in case it wasn't obvious, we didn't wait. Because um, it was pretty stable. I was like, why not? <laughs> and it's part of our New Year's dinner. Here we go. I do this. And then Here. How is it? Good. Yeah? Ooh, all together. All right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Must be good. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Happy New Year, everybody.
Hope you had a good new year. <laughs> Love you, bye. Happy New Year. <laughs> it's broken! Yes! Well, that's why Happy New Year to me.